Here is the old solar panel with the old mount that we came up with. And you can see we use the unistrut and a door hinge type of system and it's uh, rusted a little bit. But I, I just have it off the pole right now. Okay. And this right here is actually the new design right here. I give a lot of the credit to my dad for figuring this one out. Uh, but what we basically do is we have um, an old satellite mount. Um, these are actually new, but you can use old satellite mount. Uh, mounts but here, lift this okay and you can see it just has two unistruts attached to it and it's actually the satellite mount that mounts to like the wall or a block or something like that and it's a straight piece and it goes to about a two inch pipe and it fits perfectly just like that and we've already drilled the holes that will make this sturdy and the angle is adjusted right now at about 25 degrees uh, for all of them okay just like that. So it is movable, but we're going to make it static. And then this whole, um, uh, the solar panels are going to go across. We're going to have about five of them on these three poles. Um, and it's a couple feet. Each pole is a couple feet in the ground. As you can see, we just put it in. I'm giving some time for the ground to harden. And I also brought out my new piping to go from my junction box, the J box right here. And these are my grape solar panels. So we're going to go from the junction box, straight line, and there's going to be a junction box right here. So we're going to have a piece of unistrut. Let me back up here. Uh, we're going to have a piece of unistrut going across here. Okay, to hold everything and make the whole system sturdy. And then we're going to have the two pieces of unistrut going across. Uh, just like that. But uh, it's pretty neat. Um, it's really sturdy. So basically you're looking at, uh, I'd say for the poles, about $10 to $15 per pole. And then we have... Um, about ten dollars for the satellite mount and then ten to maybe twenty bucks total for one uh, I believe it was 20 foot section I'll have to double check the prices but uh, pretty cheap um, overall each one is under twenty bucks versus say twenty to thirty uh, just for this mount right here they don't even uh, sell this one at northern tools anymore but you can see that this is just at forty five degrees it's not adjustable plus you gotta put the unistrut here plus i had to get the u-bolts uh... and the uh, board here whereas this is pretty simple and i think what we're going to do is just use this uh, from now on and uh, i've already made room and cleared here and this uh, shed old shed that's falling apart is going to go and uh, basically we're just going to create rows here and row and then uh, i've got a single 12 volt line the ground that's going to go here and also uh, uh, our string our string which is about 100 volts so there's going to be three wires going through this so I'm going to be doing that today trenching that putting it here uh, solar panels have already been ordered and they'll be uh, here uh, within the week and I'll start installing those and uh, make a video and show how I'm doing that so again yeah.